Brandon and Paper Rex fought each other on this map. It was Forsaken on the Sova. This time he is back on that jet and he has been incredible so far in this tournament. But Mind Freak off to a good start there. Catching out Jesse Bash. No lineups for you, good sir. Wits and Dubstep on the board. Oh, and Bren Esports now taking two so far. 4v3 situation, but Bren Esports, they're not gonna overcommit onto that B site. Dispenser here playing with his third Forsaken though. Gonna beat down Dispenser there. And now it's 3v3 through the middle. Dubstep though, One stepping on Forsaken there for court. Borkum in the meantime, catching out the Vi as well. It seems like for Ben Esports, they're just finding all of these pickoffs. Ben Esports, even though they are at the gates here knocking, saying hello, we're about to attack the Alpha site. Not necessarily stepping on the gas just yet. He might find the timing and he does! Dubstep! A second sense on him! He's got that Spidey sensors and he does get the kill on Forsaken too. Dubstep sense, it just tingles there and Forsaken, he will get tickled fancied by the Phantom there of Dubstep. For Ben Esports, they lost a few lives a while ago, but they kept the Phantom in hand. Dubstep making wonders happen with this rifle. Drop on down, trying to go for the chase down. Paper so in the meantime, still ready to contest, but Ben Kai caught out there by Wits. Borkum on the board as well, and Bren Esports, this is one of the hottest starts we've ever seen from them. Paper Rex has to back on away. Keep an eye out on Mind Freak. He blew the minds of people a while ago. He's gonna do it again with two beautiful exit frags. And for PRX, David at the very least, and try and make the opposing team. And Ben Kai, he's trying to go for the shot, but dubstep since he couldn't get the proper parkour onto the green box early on. I played avoiding the shot there. Forsaken though, find you and dice you up with those blades that Forsaken has right now. Forsaken. This man lives up to every single inch of his name, gets the pick off on the board game and brings it now to a 5v3 in the favor of Paper Rex. Even on an ego situation, you can never count out the Tyrannosaurus Rex with Paper Rex right now because it is going to be another shot followed up here by Bankai, who has been so accurate on that Marshall, laying things down. You don't have a hall pass, try and peek me, but Wits is gonna answer back. A great retaliation to that, and the res will come up online to bring it to four to three. Oh, Shiba. Still, oh. Shiba, a double oh. pick off. He's answered back, and the Marshall's just laying down everything here. Beginnings of one at the very least at the end of this series. Whoever wins this is going to Berlin. Ren Esports on the path to doing that with an opening three round lead but now it's cut down to two by paper rex mind freak on the jump peak here and we did point out that early on he already had that viper's bit which can be crucial and is gonna have to be for the side paper rex oh, with dispenser oh, shutting down the push from forsaken quickly taken off of the board and that's a huge pick to find mind freak could not find the follow-up as dubstep is two steps ahead here of the competition finding a double opener and suddenly the b-side is right for the taking but shiba is going to answer back dubstep a triple kill shutting him down he knows where everything is and enough space to plant by those shock darts are going to keep him at bay for the meantime the plant will go down from wits dubstep on the updraft not able to land the shot but he's going to fall back instead bankai on the back of the side which wits is going to confirm and suddenly this is looking like another round for brandex Brand Esports looking to seize territory and looking to take advantage of this Icebox map. But on the flip side, Mind Freak now going for that final plan. It's gonna be the Viper Spit into play. It's all about the smog here. The poison will cover up the site. But Borkum right now with that takedown. And Jesse Vash, there's the guarantee. One kill off the Shiva. It's all up to Mind Freak right now. But Brand Esports, all they need to do. Thank you, Forsaken, trying to make a play. And that he almost does. Dubs are barely able to get out of there. And Devi will confirm the kill. At the device show they're finding one at the very least and paper rex is not done with this game whatsoever four rounds is nothing here two prx said to themselves they are not going to be extinct anytime soon no disaster will slay them no way brandy sports is going to run away with this without prx putting up a fight and forsaken right now he has been the one to watch out for and there you go the holy prayers of forsaken will hit the shots onto two so far the gospel of forsaken here yet again saying and praying but here we have it which right now has to back on the way prx making their voices and verses be heard here black and blue it's 5v2 and forsaken is not done oh, oh! oh! it's a servant from above and in the meantime, the plant cannot go down just yet. Paper Rex doing a great job of delaying time here, making things a lot more tasty for their defense. But Dubstep will opening one. things up on the pick. The Spencer is going to find one, but Dubstep a double kill. Shiba somehow finds one of his own. Bankai will get that kill. The plant does not have enough time to get planted down, and they will secure the round just based off of utility and plant. The Hello, still. Yeah, Brandon Esports just dipping their toes onto a site here. And a good spam from Mind Freak already trying to break down that wall before it's even fortified. 
Spike now planted the Viper above and time for the double lock. That's Venn Diagram here, but the only one caught in the crossfire is gonna be Borkum. The Vito look for a second one there. Forsaken the Meatpot with the backstab with the operator, but dubstep with the punish in response. Now then, Brent's lockdown doesn't get any detains, none whatsoever. 3v4 instead. High ground still here for the side of PRX and the Vi, he's looking to build one more wall on up to try and get that thief. He's on down and PRX to clean up house. It's all up to dubstep right now. And can Dubby go for the clutch? It's all up to him here versus my freak. No takedowns whatsoever. As as PRX will get there that Forsaken is there. He can still back off. He does have that dash to try and pull away, but he's gonna try and re-aggress. Even though he knows the Aldron is there, quite ill-advised, and Borkum oh, will punish him for it. Jesse Bash getting the trade-off though on the Bankai. It's a far B3. What an intriguing position there from Bankai. He gets one kill but does fall in the field of battle. But Shiva though giving Jesse Bash a taste of his own medicine with the shock darts. And PRX holding the line now to make it 3v2. The black and blue. This scoreline, it, it was one. It was two for PRX heating up. Just keeping warm. Wits and Dispenser here. And as they go for the mid-push, Wits not going to get the takedown onto the Vine. Can they go for more though? Vent guy here on top of the ramp. And an easy lineup to get Paper Rex here. Going back in the later stages of it. Forsaken did not land a shot. And with that, Dubstep will punish him every single time. This is going to be another one here for the Dubstep highlight reel. The blades are out. We've seen this before. And maybe Deja Vu. Perhaps here for Ben Esports, and there you go, surgical strike. Gonna be a knife in the eye there of Mind Freak. First takedown, picks up the operator, Chiba. He's been stellar here with the darts, and he's looking to give in a shocking, shocking ovation if Ren Esports decides to go for the push. Reconnaissance first is the name of the game. Jesse Bash now following his own fire to the other side. But for Ren Esports, they're trying to psych out the opposition, give Dubstep a chance to go for a pickoff, and he... Now the plant will go down to that A site. Brent Esports looking to take the lead once more here in this round after Paper X have tied things up. And once, when you know that Dubstep has a blade storm, you know you're in for a treat, especially with the spicy shots he's been landing all game. Oh, him. Out, it seems like it's only Bank Guy who's even going to try that endeavor. Wits is going to shut him down. It should be a round for Brent to bring it six to five. Bro, a round of applause though for Dubai. Another smart play from this stage. We saw him be so objective based a while ago, but this time he ch now then PRX is still have the operator, the blade storm as well as that lockdown. So two ultimates plus that snipe. We're gonna help them out immensely. But for Bren, what's the play here? Can they get wits a single kill to give them that resurrection if ever? Oh, but it's forsaken to land the opener on dispenser. Trying to lurk there towards the mid-position, but Forsaken's gonna catch him out every single time. So so fearless on those mid pushes and Devi once again challenging the tube here. Borkum taking on down. This is looking like we're going in a 6-6 six to six to the second half Dax. But the res will come up from Wits. They're able to secure that ultimate orb. But Forsaken trying to go high up will not land it. But Devi and Bankai both shutting him down. It's all on the Dubstep and Jesse Bash. The last hope for the round. Dubstep able to find one. The double kill this way. And Dubstep getting the triple. He's now halfway through his own blade storm. Will it be make it happen right now? It's on the Shiba and Devi for Paper Rex. But Dubstep, oh, indubitably, he still gets away somehow. 30 HP on Dubstep. There's a sliver of hope here for Bren. Hold down, game strong from Dubstep. How many times did you just correct this aim? And now as Dubstep decides to take... Top of the nest and... Oh dear, this is a very hard plan to try and oh. defuse. But Forsaken on point finds the Spencer. They don't need a microphone here, black and blue. They just need to get on site and fast. And PRX there with the opening frag versus the Spencer. Big pickoff. No turret now here for Ben Esports. But Jesse Bash on the board. Borkum in the meantime getting one as well for the PH squad. And it's 3v3 right now. Ben Kaito still playing on the high ground by the belt here. And we also see Mind Freak lobbing a snake bite to the other side. But Wits now with a defuse. Can Ben Esports get away with this? So little HP now here for the side of Wits. He will have to back on away after the half defuse now. And Jesse Bash lobs that dark. Borkum now with the takedown and Bren Esports they timed that perfectly side friend though respecting the arsenal of PRX understanding that they're gonna be a little bit in a pickle if they decide to go for that firefight early on but Jesse Bash he finds Shiba there 5v4 right now PRX does put the spike down here black and blue but Bren looking for that retake looking to at least reconvene before going on a site I like the discipline here by uh, Brand Esports. Even though they found that opening pick, they give it up and they're trying to go for the full 5v5 retake. But Forsake is going to find that opening pick and Divine's going to find one of their own. Dubstep will answer back here in the Mind Freak, but it's a quick 3v3. Now suddenly Wits on the push. Will they even know that he's here in the back of the site? Divine landing the shot on the Wits. 
and still holding on to the line your device been doing such a good job of keeping things locked down for the side of paper rex that's a 1v1 between bankai and Brobstep. the the nano swarms will force him off of it and he knows that the time is ticking bankai will secure the round here but for a second okay realizing that the turret is there inside the kitchen Smoke it off to let him peek a bit deeper than you otherwise would have might have been able to, but the Spencer! But Brent Esports found the Isolate instead, and that's a beautiful pick off onto Forsaken, one of the biggest targets on the PRX roster. But here we go, Jesse Bash now lobbing those shock darts to the default, trying to buy some time here for the side of Brent Esports divide though. Can he actually get that pixel plant on? Which in the meantime with the kill off the Shiba, Mind Free catching out the Spencer inside the smog, and time is ticking as the spike is planted. Ben Kai though looks for the backstab, and this might be the perfect time here for Ben Kai. Mind Free though still on the inside this is his domain and the snake is gonna be in that grass in the ice here two for two three so far with only a single hp point left he goes for the res there we go with the nasar being thrown up here by bentai and there's the peak right now by wits but bentai will get two so far to make it three in a row for the round 1v1 between the killjoys dispenser in a safe ground here but never mind the wall back from bentai he trying to make a player here back so Let's see if it's gonna work out because you can see early aggression coming from dubstep on a main but forsaken flying high and above and mind freak gonna shut bork him down on me anyway but this is just not gonna be the case here so far unless they find a pickoff for themselves the defense right now holding the line there we saw the shot from jesse bash but he's gonna get seen taken down by bentai instead with still trying to go for that wall the spencer in the meantime with the kill of the forsaken while the distraction was there but really some of these Plays that Freddy's Sports are trying to do here. Paper X getting the read anyway. And it's 4v3 here, black and blue, as PRX putting that spike down on that default B plant. Barely able to get that plant down with enough space. They do have a retake situation on their hands here, Brandy Sports. It's a 3v4. And Brandy Sports are going to have to try and make something happen. Dubstep, he's got those blades. And Dispenser's got the lockdown, but they've yet to really apply it. Time is of the essence here. And they looked the wrong way at the wrong moment. Divi finds the pickoff. Wits able to find one of the Shiba. But he's going to have to find even more. The whiff coming here. And Dubstep will capitalize on that. Not pulling out the blades just yet. The lockdown here to come from Benkai will be shut down. Dubstep, what a shot from him. But off on the angle. Vine Trick's going to land the shot. And Wits is going to destroy the lockdown. He secured the round. Barely enough time, I think, to get the defuse. Oh, will he be able no to do it? No, he no does time. not. You saw the aura come in on the spike itself, and they have secured round. Both trying to finally make their dynasties come true in the first place. Dispenser finding a double just when he's been having a cold game on the sandy shores of Icebox. He comes alive here. Bankai to answer back, and he will get the dink on the Mind Freak. Not able to confirm the kill, but he's done his job to go two for one and almost get a third at the end of it. So the heal. Well, rather, his life here, Mind Freak, not taken down just yet. Shiba will get the trade off, and Wits will do the same, but Shiba, oh my dear, answering back, and it's all on the Borkum. Now, Borkum, he's one of the most consistent players in a clutch situation, just as Wits is his teammate. And he will end the shot, but almost able to find Mind Freak at the end. on in. It's a special delivery here. It's a quick airdrop from the side of Forsaken, but while the objective has in place, it's subset now with a takedown. Lockdown, though, is taking on away. And PRX scrambling to get away from the Dome of Doom. Bentai though does get spotted. See now by Dubstep. There's the flick into the takedown after correcting his aim. And it's all up to Dispenser here to go for the defuse. Got halfway done already. Shiba though will cancel it out with the Hunter's Fury. There we go with a stick perhaps. Never mind. Drop down yet again. And PRX, they're playing with the opposition. Brendo in the meantime, they need to secure that spike immediately. Borkum though with two so far. All up to Divi right now. And will this be the decisive blow? Will this be PRX Ooh. making it work? No, it's going to be the call. Rex though buying space from the cells with that lockdown and here we go on this fury right now oh, does it actually get punished though no, it doesn't dispenser and Borkum get to take us instead and forsaken he just whiffed their immense Rex it felt like they could have actually made the play there but Bren Esports they were the ones more secure with their shots that was very uh uncharacteristic as he said yeah. there you know that after that when he pulls out the blade storm something is to come can they stop the storm that forsaken's about to bring that's a question dubstep's gonna try and bring one of his own forsaken able to find a double kill this is what we're talking about dax he gave you the one now here's the three kills coming for forsaken now suddenly at the cusp of match point 
Paper Rex, they're making it happen. They brought this to a 5v2, and that was the one. Here's the three. Forsaken, he's come alive. The prodigy of SGMY, and now he gets you the fourth. Will he cap off the game with an ace? Yes, yes. he will! Forsaken! Three. Here we go, Forsaken, though, up top the box. He has been the loudest voice so far of PRX, but Dubstep sees Forsaken there, blinded quite a little bit by the guiding lights. And that's gonna be dubstep with the takedown. Seems like Brent Esports taking advantage of that situation. I think it was a flash from Devi actually. The team flash there. Such of the caliber that is Paper Rex. And so Paper Rex on the B site attack Borkum. Trying to play it close. They say keep your enemies afar. Well, keep them closer this time. Wits finding a double somehow on mid, but Devi's gonna answer back. And Jesse Bash is gonna find one of his own. A quick 1v3. It's all on Devi. I mean, the closer they are, the easier they are to shoot. And Devi now the only one left. Does have the spike in hand? Can he make it in time to put that spike down? Yes, he does, but he needs to commit, and because of that, his hands sack same lineup on each side. Forsaken, though, he sees Wix, hits the head there. In the meantime, Dubstep right now going after Forsaken, does get a takedown, looking for more, and Dubstep is hungry, and Dubstep will get to. Ben Kaito in response, deathmatch now in the middle, and things are just falling apart in terms of formation because it's all about killing each other in the middle of the map. There's Borkum now getting on the board after Dubstep has gotten three. And all eyes now are on Shiba. They don't know though where he is. And now he will expose his position with a backstab there onto Dubstep. 2v1 though. Friend Esports. They can set things up well here by the spike. And it's up to Shiba to figure out what's going on. But oh, he went for a quick Aljo in there back in blue. And I'm worried here because Jesse Vash is just hiding on the side. Shiba might not know his counterpart is there. He still confers the kill on the floor from anyway. 1v1. Oh, but Shiba does it anyway. It's a clutch here for Paper Rex. And spacing out versus Paper Rex, you will get punished by it. That's just it. Any kind of idle time will not help you whatsoever. And here we go with Dispenser pushing on forward to get the takedown on the Forsaken. Oh, Brand Esports are looking clean here so far on their hold. And it's all up to Divide right now. He does have a rifle in hand. Can he get a few pickoffs just to end the round here? At least give Paper X something to be happy about. Oh, oh Divide though, this is going to be the show here too here from Divide. Duel the opposition because Paper Rex, they will always have that fight back. And right now, they are going to be fighting on back with the Blade Star instead. It is an equal state here for PRX, and they are going to go for the push. But Bentai there, effective enough to catch up Borkum after he gets one. Dispenser on the board, but Forsaken flying on high. It does feel like the graces of Forsaken will just be too much to handle there for Jesse Bash. 3v3 though, and actually get Wits here to get some confirmation with the Guiding Lights. Neural Def going to be into play instead, saying hello to the other side. And PRX waiting for friend to come. Dispenser though, the first target, Forsaken with that take down there we go with the trailblazer scouting on the round and dubstep with his own blades here mark we gonna go on down and can dubstep find these two last targets benkai right behind this rook and what's the call here for dubstep forsaken though guys go for the backstab he cannot hit all around no matter what they will have the firepower to do so they will have the gunplay to do so and they have the skill in spades in their roster for now though forsaken just going for the operator, looking for a target or two. It's all about the cyber cages though on site. But Dubstep and Dispenser are coming on close and getting takedowns. The DD connection getting two so far. Shiva though and Divide on the board as well. Wits in the meantime with the answer. And now it's 3v2. Can Forsaken find the angle here on the east side of the pyramids? The Vide though coming on close. Forsaken now with a takedown one. Wits there with a the frenzy. And it's 2v1. 52 HP left here for Forsaken. He catches out Jesse back there. Guys, like gonna be into play, but the fake flash doesn't work. Forsaken does not fall for it. But they're gonna have to continue that. Street. For the meantime, this Forsaken is going to open things up here with the Operator. Place from each side. This time though, it feels like there's a little bit more of subtlety right now from the PRX movement. And yes, they have the flashy place. They get the kills. Brendo in the meantime though, just a stellar defense from them as well. But really, there's a lot more reservation coming into map number two. And the respect given to each side is something we know this. Dubstep though in the meantime does catch out the Vi as Forsaken catches out Dubstep there in response. Three here, four Forsaken so far. Swapping over to the Phantom. The Hunt the Fury was called there. And Forsaken! Taken with the shorty support. They were at that disadvantage. Brand new sports right now. An opening pick here from Dubstep. That's a good answer back now. Forsaken though, missing the shot. Same days there for Dubstep. Jitters from both sides. It's now going to be 5v3 as Jesse Bash waits patiently versus Bentai. And we've seen PRX play patience before here on a map like this, especially with some of the lurks. In this case now, Brand new Esports in prime positions and with prime punishment. But Shiva with a beautiful takedown there on the Dubstep. Jesse Bash waits right now with the kills. And well, that's going to be that. Brand new. Well, shooting Paper Rex in the back of it afterwards. 
the B-side push. We haven't seen this much coming from Paper Rex, but they've been so far successful on that oh, endeavor by Barkham! Oh Barkham, Barkham, Barkham! Three kills for him, almost giving him the fourth. Forsaken answering back, but Bankai's got the response to all of that, too. It's a 3v2 here right now. Bren, they are two picks away from tying the game up next. Tick tock walking to the clock as we saw a bit of Borkum time there waiting on the angle. Wix right now looking for the take out of Jesse Bash with the guarantee and Jesse Bash with two there. So Bash, so. And full sense, but I mean, Brand versus Paper X, they're making a case for their own. And Dubstep finds Forsaken. That's a huge pick for him to find. A confidence boost in a half as well. Isn't that the case though, Black and Blue? When your rivals fall, find someone else to compete with. And what better dance partner for Brand Esports? Well, for Paper Paper Rex on the other side, looking for the tango. But Dubstep right now, he's going for his own symphony here with the operator. On the flip side, though, it's already PRX down to three members. Jesse Bassett with a shot start yet again. Scope on in. It's Mind Free actually he does get the takedown to go for the push on forward. Dubstep, though, looking to hold the line. Has to back on the way. Up drafts, but can't get out of dodge and can't get out of the way of Mind Freak. Now then, Wits, though, waiting at the exit. Backs inside the cave. As the guiding light, and okay, left. it's time now to just shoot on out, and it seems like Borkum was ready. again, just as we saw on map oh. number one, but Borkum, he's gonna catch Forsaken looking the wrong way, changing up the positions right now, and Forsaken was none the wiser, brings it to a 5v. In here, it's a black and blue, an exodus to A side. Will we see PRX make it there in the first place? How will Brent stop them here with the positioning? Well, that's gonna be the first sign. Up step now with a takedown on the Shiba. And it's 3v5 as oh the blade storm gets the oh. surgical strikes on to two more three here from dubstep barkham with that final kill endeavor but now the push from paper rex currently trying to hold on to the ace site here as brand are successfully taking that mid control and trying to try and just force their way into the site but dubstep will be taken down mind freak finding a pickoff as his own but it's a 2v2 either way dax and now we're in the 3v3 Oh, Shiba though, backstab is gonna be a go. Jesse Bash gonna get dinked there, and now Shiba will get that takedown. 3v2 situation here as Bren Esports will try to at the very least sniff out where Paper X is stationed, and Wits will get that first target. Second one perhaps here for Borkum so far. Shiba though from in behind, he's been clutched before. Can he do it again? Ghost in hand versus Light Armor on the other side, but Borkum, all he needs is a. Finally, you can see the rest of Dubstep and Wits trying to aggress here on mid just in case there's a flying coming on, but Wits might go going for a flank himself. The Vile find that pig on the dispenser that's huge for the retake to be even more possible here borkham still two points away from his ultimate so that won't be coming up online anytime soon for the most part and he could potentially find the frag and he does a double for borkham that's his ultimate online but he's taken down dubstep's able to find one of his own goodbye removed off of the board and dubstep coming up alive again it's all on the bank guy can he make the clutch happen we saw 1v3 come in from shiva but bank guy's gonna receive this round he's gonna have to go for the save here dubstep trying to hunt him out and he will do successfully not gonna land that shot dubstep's gonna have to be quicker about it wits and spencer they've crawled their way up here into the b site shiba's gonna find the pick off on dubstep but i don't think they have any idea that the mid control here has really been given away that much and divide will he find him he will but not the pick as dispenser answers back my freak's gonna find borkum holding on to the back of the site itself regal bolt landing right on him and they confirm the kill through that jesse bash great job by him but for a second's gonna answer back not able to land the shot here in dispenser to deny the plant and the plant will go down 2v3 right now in the favor of paper x but they're gonna have to make the comeback here here. The retake happened. They know that the Spencer gun. is on the pillar itself. The time is ticking. They're gonna have to play this one perfectly. Man, the Shiba darts are just so stellar here for Paper Rex. Ben Taido will take advantage. Shiba though does go down the hand of the Spencer, but it's 2v1. Oh. Camera now gonna be a play looking for that eye in the series. Brandy Sports, they're gonna try and play their hand perfectly here. Dash up by the dubstep. Taking lots of damage through the smoke, but mind freaking forsaken! They just completely destroy the push here from Brand Esports. Dubstep's able to find one, but not much more. Divide answering back. It's a complete shot. Might see wit here if he goes to the right hand side, and there you go! Perfect center master for Forsaken. Gets that takedown, and PRX still rampaging in this round. Forsaken. Even with that takeoff, even when they have the man advantage, he wants to continue to re-aggress and Dispenser's gonna find the frag here in the Divide, Forsaken eventually taken down by Borkum. Now, 4v3 in the favor of Bren. They got those blades, they got the Vipers bit up online as well. Shotgun will push Bankai back from the door switch itself. If you're trying to catch him off guard and Dispenser, he will. A second kill by him, Dubstep timing in on the fight, and it's now off. Find an early pickoff with the Sheriff, and then switch on over, but... 
Nobody's really giving that information away. They now know where he is. He can save the Vandal here. The flank is on him. No, it doesn't even matter. As Those are the two words they wanted to keep an answer. Map point, or in this case, it's map point now to tie up the series and force a map number three. And we can do this case here. PRX, they are able to get on away. They are also going to look to help on out inside the hallway sheet, but catching a dub step there. 5v4 right now, still the up in the hands of the Jet, but friend, they want to go for CQC here, my friend. It's going to be the Viper Spit in the play beside, behind, or in the middle, actually, of the Pyramids. Fen Kaido catching out the Spencer, and PRX looking pretty surgical here, finding the pickoffs that they need. Danger close to for Forsaken as Borkum gets in his face. And it's now 2v3 as that spike is being, well, they're looking for it. They found it now. And it will be navigated to the center of that green supply. Confirming danger close on that one there, Captain Dax and Borkum. This is where he breathes. He likes to take those fights up close. Wits is able to find the double. They're a single round away, a single kill away from bringing us into map number three. And all Mind Freak has is a judge, a sheriff in hand. But in that smoke, that is when it can be the deadliest. Can they catch him off guard here? This Mind Freak is on the prowl. He is a viper himself, but this is not the poison that he's grown up with. He's trying to live in it, but Borkum has been birthed by it now the mind freak he will be trying to go crazy here a sense rather if Brandon esports is able to take us once in a map for Brandon esports it was spotless now they have given one loss each to each other but the records are still absolutely stellar so far for now though here we go into the round and paper rex have put that spike down Brandon esports though looking for the retake already wit's gonna be there on the left hand side shiba though ready for the classic shiba dart as that was guiding light trying to move on forward but does get caught in the crossfire dubstep though in the meantime dashing on in past the staircase Spencer for taking on the board dubstep in the meantime does get kill there but the fight went two so far it's not oh. gonna be 3v1 make that oh all of the Borkum here divide there with a triple kill gun kai on the board as well and they're just trying to make the old dream come true to go to berlin but now this is their first chance for sagan pushing on here which is gonna get caught off guard even with a weapon but he had his knife out Borkum holding down the line for the meantime but dubstep's gonna answer back mind freak doing one of his own and dubstep rather dispenser will return the favor to dubai 1v2 Pulled here by the gravity well, but the weight of the world is on his shoulders. He's gonna lift that up. He might be the Atlas of his team here, Dispenser. The double DND connection, not able to help him out for the meantime, but he is a clutch player of his own. A veteran of the scene. Time and time again, he's been put in this situation, and time and time again, he has prevailed. But can he do it? on one of the biggest stages of his life so far. They're double stacking Hell and Dispenser. He's looking to send them from whence they came, but he is still on Heaven here on the rafters. He has some information that they're playing close to him, but I'm not sure if he can exactly catch him off guard here. The time is ticking and Dispenser, the sands of it, are not hollowing in his favor. He dropped their young gun. They want the prodigy here, their messiah, to be on the board as quickly as possible. There you have it. Forsaken with the first chapter of this Exodus. That's going to be a takedown onto Dispenser. Dispenser. And this is going to be the book of Forsaken. Looking for a takedown of two. Jesse Bash having to back on away. Low HP already. And here comes PRX trying to clear things out as soon as possible. Nebulous now in the way. Smokes will dissipate though. And Jesse Bash trying to make that Odin count. It's PRX though. Pushing on forward again to the pit of the site. And this is gonna be a good sign for them. They get the guiding light. They get the take down on Jesse Vash, and it's 5v3 now. Those flashes are so hard to counter when it's Divi on the other end of it, and they secure the round for the most part here. It's on the dubstep, but what can you do? It's a 1v5. You have an operator in your hands. Maybe get a pick off here and there, but it will be a double screen coming in for them. All three peaks, not able to land a single one in that one. Dubstep, and they have to try and save. His operator, that's all he's got to work with. They're baiting him out here and they're just toying with him at this point. They lose another round here. This could be a done deal. Dubstep not able to land the shots through the Seekers, but Jesse Vash there with the shock dart taking down Forsaken. It's a big pick for him. He's gonna come out with a signature. Oh, then a 4K from Jesse Vash! He's done it time and time and time and time and time again! Divai, how does he do it to come back into that one? But there is no chance here for him to get the round any further. Defy, they've been clutch in the past. Dispenser spots him out and he sees him in return. For many players and many teams in SEA, and it's been something Brent Esports has been able to rely on. But this is the second one there. Jesse Bash, also reliable yet again. There we they secure the round, but they got the lockdown views here. Not the same fortune for Paper X as it was Bankai who was first taken down, and they do take down Borkum. 
which is a big pick to find here for Mind Freak on that Astra as well. Opposing Astra finding each other, but Forsaken finding the pick off on the Wiz, looking to make a play, but the Spencer and Dubstep, he's way too quick on that, finding Forsaken, his own rival, and now they're down to a 2v3. The plant can go down here, but they're going to have to rescind control of the site real quick and back off maybe to main. As the lockdown is still up online. Sheba, Defy, how do they do it? It was a 2v3. Sheba from a previous edition of Paper Rex to the active field, and he is not disappointing whatsoever. Dubstep now does go down. Big denied there from the Silva. Dispenser here by the Cubby as well. But Brent Esports, they're falling apart at the seams from the get-go PRX with the entry frags that they need. And it does seem like if this keeps up, this is where Paper X can truly shine. Can Bren Esports fight on back? Can the voices of the masses be heard there for the side of Bren Esports? Or will Paper X cover it? And come down even when they have the man disadvantage and win the round. The plant will go down for them for the meantime. Recon Bolt will give them away. Plant will be on triple itself. And now Shiba, oh dear. He's done it again. He's found the pick. That's the second this round for him. He's going to pull out the Aldron for information and they have to be careful here. Here comes out now the Hunter Spirit from Shiba himself, but he's capitalizing on it. Bang! He's been such a master of it compared to the rest of the SCA scene. I think he's one of the best, if not the best, who can make those plays work in the first place. And Davai has been incredible so far. Forsaken though, he just glides like an angel past the shed. And Jesse Vass is going to get a face full of his grace. Mind Freak on the board there. Bankai now catching the Kamikaze of Dubstep. And it will be 4v2. Brent East. Sports. They're on the ropes here, One and Paper Rex is in control. This Spencer gonna go on down. It's all up to Borkum here planted. and now. But the problem for Brent Esports, the I'm usual suspects for the clutch there at the lower half of that scoreboard. But this is gonna be a time for Borkum to wind that clock back. 11 bullets in the chamber, 3 targets with 1 low on the HP, Divide here on the left hand side, and Borkum right now waiting for an opportunity, but the fu- The game's even. Benkai, he does get that pick off here on the wits. No more Seekers online to play here, but the mixed buy, the shoddy buy on the final round from Brand Esports gonna have to come in big, but Shiba, he is so deadly, he is the biggest detriment, honestly, right now, along with Forsaken for Brand Esports. The reads here from Paper X have been incredible, and just goes to show the absolute on this roster. Ben Kaido on the board, Dispenser will fight on back. But now it's going to be locked down and the Spencer actually One caught there. Remaining. Might not have seen, but and this is the makings of the champion. This is natural that you can go for, but no. here we have it. Shorty surprise, perhaps no squad. It might be the time now, the SGMY region, to take that top spot. Jesse Bash, at least making the shot in fast. 20 seconds left, and if the Spencer cannot clear out this B site, I am worried here for Brand Esports. There you have it. Borkum though, going for more, but might freaking me time with the takedown. Here we have it. Brand with a hustle on the V site, but time is ticking. Keep an eye on that clock. Guiding light gonna be there. The Spencer looking to hold the line. Where is the spike? But where is the Vi? He's inside the boat house. Looking for the kill off the wits. There we go. The Spencer is protecting his teammate, but Ben Kai with the deny. And Paper Rex are on match point. One more round, One and it's enemy. thin thread that you walk on when you go for an execute that late it was made popular by navi early on in the previous days but what do you want to be in now paper rex with the economy in their way they're looking to close this one off brand esports this is not a good situation to be in and it would be unfortunate for them to go down with a whimper here forsaken securing that one dubstep going down dax this is not looking good i think the seal is in the deal it's all on jesse vash for the specter there you go, get the candle box because this is the Paper Rex Street right here. No other team can represent SEA better than Paper Rex Mixed Roster. Strong result, and now they're on the hunt. Paper Rex, they're gonna- Happened there to Bren. 